I'm Captain Mike, and I'm here to show y'all how to detail a boat. Down here in South Louisiana, most of us have probably either known somebody that owns a boat, or some of us may even own our own. And the most important thing about owning a boat is keeping it clean. Your boat's not going to run every year and every year out if you don't keep it clean. The salt water and all the corrosiveness that gets in this boat when you go fishing or recreational skiing, you're definitely going to want to rinse this boat off and use the proper equipment, soaps, and even wax your boat to keep it from getting corrosion and also keep the resale value up. The first thing we're going to do is make sure we get all of our fishing equipment and electronics out of the boat. So right here, we have our Garmin chalk plotter display. We're going to go ahead and get that out safely. Next thing we have down here is our safety devices and our equipment box. We're going to get all that out the boat. Also take our fishing rods out. Starting at the front of the boat, we're going to mix a bucket filled with some of this boat soap right here. I've got my bucket filled. We're going to get our sponge wet. And you're just going to want to wet the whole front of this boat up here. It's going to start to break up some of the dust and the grime that's accumulated in storage or out on the water. What we have here is a Mr. Clean Magic Eraser. And it's going to get any black streak marks, any really any stains that will get out of this unless you stain it with Bleacher 409, which I do not recommend using on any material on the surface of a boat. Once Bleacher 409 hit the sun, it completely stains it yellow and it's ruined for good. You can't get that out. Blast this with some fresh water. And we're about good to go up here on the deck of the boat. Everything washes right away and is going to be down onto the ground. What we're going to use up here to finish off the deck of the boat is a wet dry vac. We're going to vacuum out all of our compartments, get the rest of the dirty standing water out of the bottom of the boat, and it'll also get any dirt. When we're working on the hull, we're really just going to make sure that we work in sections. You don't want to skip any spot out here. The performance of the boat can be affected by how clean the outside is and also the wax that we're going to apply after we completely wash this boat is not going to stick and it's not going to last as long unless this hole is completely clean. Start from the top, make your way down to the bottom. You're not going to want to miss any spots. Right now we're just focusing on getting some soap coverage going to get it applied and then we'll focus on really scrubbing and working areas that need to be concentrated on. Fresh water, we're going to rinse off all of the soap, any of the dirty water that's on there and the front half of this boat is going to be clean. Alright party people, I know y'all are ready to get on the water. The last thing we're going to do before you clean your boat so we can take it out for a fun day on the river is we're going to wax it. What we have here is Scotchgard 3M Marine Wax. It's going to last for over a month up to three to six months depending on the use and depending on how you store your boat. When we're waxing we're working with even smaller sections because our time limit is that much shorter. So one, two, three foot areas, you don't want to go halfway down the boat, have this get extremely dry while you're still caking it on down there. Work in manageable sections, that way as soon as we're done applying it a couple of feet back, after this has been sitting for right about a minute, circular strokes with some elbow grease is going to get this off and it will really bring out the clear coat on the side of this boat. Once we brush these tires with a hard bristle brush and we get a lot of the oil and tar off, we're going to use Armor All Tire Shine Gel. It gives it an extreme shine and really makes your boat look good when it's rolling down the road. Let's get some of this on here. Okay guys, I want to thank y'all again for watching. I'm Michael Bear, and this is how to detail a boat. Remember the main steps. You're going to want to take all of your fishing equipment and electronics out of the deck of the boat. Start from the top to the bottom, work from the front to the back, and then we can apply your wax. You're going to let that wax sit on, buff it off. Lastly, you can finish with the trailer, and then we can hit the water.
Thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned.